today we are going to be doing a Olaf rice recipe. What you're going to be needing is some eggs, two of them, one sausage, some lettuce, some white rice, salt, and one baby carrot. What you're going to need is to crack the eggs open and you're going to need some parent supervising to do this and also some help from an adult. Then when you're done that, you're going to start mixing the eggs, squash the little thingy, which is pretty hard to squish if you think of it. But you squish it and then you start stirring the egg. You're going to have to start stirring that up nicely. Don't throw any out of the bowl. Then you're going to add a little bit of sugar if you want to, just a little bit. You don't want it to turn out that sweet. Then a pinch of salt. Then some water too, which the salt fell into a bit. But it's fine. Ah! And then just stir. Now that we have the omelet all ready, we're going to get some help from our parents and they are going to cook it because we can't use the stove. We're not that old to use the stove. <laughs> Everyone knows that. Sorry about the noise, that was my cat. But anyways, um, now we're going to get our sausage and, ah, okay. I'm gonna pull this away. There we go. There we go, we did it! Yay, we did it. Okay, let's take this off and put it that way. And um, we're going to cut it in four pieces from the start off with the middle. And remember to use a kid's knife or ask your parents to do it if you want. If you don't want to do it like that, if, you want, if you're scared that you'll mess up, then just cut another little piece here and then here. Then we have four little pieces of sausage. Now we're going to cut the sausages here, we're going to cut them a bit long, so they have little long arms. And then we're gonna cut into a cross, like that, kind of, there we go. And then we're going to cut little spaces. Okay, let's cut it a bit longer a bit, there we go. Not completely like here, just, gonna, just little pieces. They don't have to be the same size or anything, just little pieces, not completely cut like that. And then we got one little octopi, and then do it all with the other ones. My mom is helping me with the white rice for the Olaf, and now we're going to now she's going to help me cook the omelet for the little hearts on the sides of the Olaf. And remember to have. Parents supervising and also help from an adult when you do stuff with hot items or dangerous sharp things. So she's going to let it cook a bit. So she, as you can see. And um, then when it gets a little bit more cooked and it seems like it's kind of better, not that soggy or anything, you have tell, to tell your parents to grab it up a bit and check if it's got done, all done. So for me, it's not done yet completely. But when you do that, you turn it. You just turn it like a little burrito while it's cooking. 
in there, just like that. It's fine if you mess up, because it doesn't have to be perfect. So then you turn it a bit more, until it's just like that. With the um, arm. to grab a brush, one of these brushes, and then you're gonna grab one of these and get some oil here, just a little bit, and then just get it all over it, all over it, just a little bit all over it. There you go, and then you grab another one, and then grab a bit more just in case. And then for 15 seconds, you're going to put it in the microwave. And if the little legs aren't spread out, you're gonna put it in for at least 10 more seconds. So then you're going to cut the omelet in some little squares like this. for decoration. Now you're going to add some lettuce for the bottom, for like some grass at least. Let's squeeze that on there. There, there, and then let's put this small piece there. So we're going to use a spoon. And I'm happy with this one a bit. And then we're going to use these, some more of this. Very yummy. And then we're going to grab it all together. Like this. And then we just cover this area up. And then we're going to put this piece there. And then here is the other piece. Nice. There we go. A bit more. Let's put it all together. And then we're going to spin it a bit. And then we're going to squeeze it up. For this piece. Let's move it a bit to the side to make it look like he's jolly and happy. And then for the little feet, we're gonna grab just a small bench. You don't want the feet to turn out too humongous. Okay, here we got the one of the feet. Let's turn it and then shave it out to be a little circle. And let's put this one right here. And then the other foot, again, not humongous piece. You don't want it to look very big, bigger than the other. We don't want that to happen. So we're going to turn, 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 and make it a small little circle too. And there, and then we're going to wait for it to get the mold. So my mom helped me make the shape of the Olaf, and now we're going to decorate it and at the end, we're going to add the face, but still not yet. So we're going to add in the nose, though. That's the part that we are going to add in. There we go. Then we're going to add the, some of the omelets here. There we go. Let's put in the omelet. There we go. There we go. There you go, Olaf. There's your little, little background. And then we're going to add some of these. Ah, there we go. Let's put them right here, right here nice and open. And this one over here, here, and then, um, I th and then you can add as many as you, you want, but I'm just gonna add two. And then we're going to figure out our face. So my mom helped me make the paper little pieces and I remember to take them off afterwards because 
you shouldn't eat paper. So let's add in the arms. Let's put them in there. There you go. There's one arm off. And there's um, your other. And give us a like if you liked Frozen 2 because I loved it. So let's add in the eyes. Let's give you some eyes off. Here's the other one, nice and big. And of course, we weren't gonna leave Olaf without a mouth. That would be sad. There you go, Olaf. And here are your little pieces, little things. I know, I remember you guys do one on this one and then one on this one. And then here's your little hair. One, two, and one tiny one here. Ta-da! And then we have our Olaf. Enjoy!